really kind of a duplicate of what's in the vehicle, the printer that's uh, mounted in the car, and then the normal laptop that the, the deputies have for not just this function, but for their day-to-day -day activity. Well, our four traveling officers that use them, um, they are adapting to it, and they, they like the program because it is saving them time of typing, um, and also everything is there. Once you swipe that card, all the information is there. All they have to do is just put the appropriate charge in there, uh, multiple tickets. It saves them time on that. Um, and the court, I don't understand likes them because, you know, Debbie's handwritings are not all the same. And now the tickets are more legible. Okay. Anything else? Okay. Any other questions? Okay. Thank and you'll see it populated. Name, driver's license, any information that was available on that driver's license that populated <coughs> into some of the descriptors down there. Birthday, height, weight, anything that was available. We still send the tickets up to the state, and when we sent the handwritten tickets up there, uh, they actually scanned those, and there was about a 20% statewide rejection rate, and that's the Department of Public Safety figure, not mine. Now, uh, with the fact, both it helps on their end because it, I think we've only had a couple of tickets returned, right. and they weren't returned because they couldn't scan it with just some little minor uh, change they wanted us to make. Uh, so as you can see, the officer's ticket has his notes for him to keep for his files, and then the ticket for the defendant, which also has the payment options at the bottom. And if you look at the efficiencies gained, I think the, the, the payback is within a, a year or two of any investment that we might have made in the thing. And then that the benefit of that investment goes on for multiple years. And it's, as Renee said, it's relatively low cost. We're actually going to try to transition to something more of a handheld device in the future.